Knoxville City Council considering a plan that could make it easier to get to a popular South Knoxville spot. Here's a look at the area we're talking about. It's Chapman Highway at Fort Avenue, right next to that new Kearns Food Hall. Our Lexi Lepoff is there talking with people who say change needs to be made. It's an exciting new addition to Knoxville, the newly renovated Kearns Food Hall. But since it's open, people say the traffic to get in and out of here has been a problem. This morning I was coming through here and I almost got um, T-boned. Just really no way to get out of here, um, turning left especially. Kearns Food Hall, the new popular spot just over the Henley Street Bridge in South Knoxville opened in April. But now facing some growing pains. Leaders with the property say there needs to be change. I'm so happy that especially South Knoxville has grown, but with that comes, you know, the added pressures of having to change the infrastructure. Right now, people must use the center turn lane on Chapman Highway, crossing oncoming traffic without a stoplight to get to the food hall, often creating backups. You're sitting there for like 20 minutes waiting for someone to let you through. A new proposal in front of city council would create a new driveway for Kearns with a traffic signal. An intersection is needed. It's just not safe. Um, you've got, you went from having just a couple hundred square feet at this intersection controlled by a light to now over 7,000 at Kearns and all the apartment complexes. Developers working closely with the city to make a plan ensuring the safety of drivers and mitigating traffic, but also laying the groundwork for the future. Kearns being here is amazing, but that stoplight is really the infrastructure that's needed to support further growth. In South Knoxville, Lexi Lepoff, WVLT News. We talked with the developers on the phone. They tell us they expect the project to be done by the end of the year, hopefully bringing relief to the traffic.